This is a nine year veteran of the Stockton Police Department who was shot multiple times after chasing a car of people suspected of carjacking a man early Wednesday morning. Now law enforcement officials from Stockton and San Joaquin County are calling this sergeant a hero for his courage. This body cam video you're about to see is graphic and we do want to warn you, viewer discretion is advised. Shots fired, shots fired, shots fired, shots fired. Yes, I call that no parent, no um, no chief, no one wants to get in the middle of the night. That call I got from D.C. Graviet was that I had an officer down. The Stockton police chief in the San Joaquin County District Attorney Thursday addressing Wednesday's sergeant involved shooting with a message to those involved. Make no mistake, everyone responsible will be prosecuted to the fullest extent of the law. Anybody who harms a police officer is in a special danger to our entire community. 20 year old Santhawan Benny Savon of Stockton is the man who police say is responsible for shooting a Stockton police sergeant after allegedly carjacking a 69 year old man, beating him with a gun and leading police on a chase through the North Stockton Valley Oak District. Police say a pistol and a rifle were used in the shooting, but they're unclear how many shooters there were. And while five total people were detained, only Savon has been charged and the others have been released. There is no more lonelier place than where that sergeant was that night. The heroic efforts, the communication, the leadership as a first line supervisor in the field was unmatchable. A true hero. The chief says the sergeant was shot multiple times, including directly to his chest, and it was his bulletproof vest that saved his life. Chief McFadden says the Stockton Police Department is down 34 officers from 393 this time last year to now 359. However, shootings are down 27 percent from this time last year to now. Despite that drop in officers, McFadden says the department is still very effective, efficient and reprioritizing its efforts. As I said before, uh, I think we're fed up in Stockton. Uh, we know incredible things happen in this city and we want to champion those incredible things and we're going to find those that are driving the violence and they're not going to stay here. Chief McFadden says he has visited the sergeant in the hospital and he is in good spirits. He says he wants to get back to work as soon as possible, but chief says this will be a long healing process. Savon is scheduled to be arraigned in court tomorrow. Reporting in Stockton, covering local news that matters, I'm Zach Boetto, Fox 40 News.